Welcome back. This is Open Exchange, and we are coming to you live from the CNBC TV 18 Motilal Oswal studio. Well, for starters, the SX50 is indicating a bit of a pullback, but we have been telling you all the stocks you need to focus on. So it's a good time now to get in some derivative strategies. Rajesh Palvia, the VP of Technical and Derivative Research at Access Securities, joins us on the show. Hi, Rajesh. Good morning. What do you have for us? It's going to be a bit of a tricky start to trade. Uh, good morning, Ali. Yeah, so throughout the month, uh, we are stuck in the range. Uh, Nifty is not going anywhere. Uh, it's uh, trading in the broad range of 17,700 to 18,100. 18, uh, looking at the expiry setup now, uh, we expect that, you know, uh, market is going to expire around 17,800, 850 zone uh, because a lot of call writing activity was there uh, around 17,900, 18,000 strike uh, in the last two trading sessions. So looking at the overall setup, yes, uh, uh, these all levels are uh, going to act as a major hurdle for the market. As uh, we are getting that, you know, negative opening, uh, as GX Nifty is indicating that, you know, we are going to have a gap down opening. But again, uh, looking at the setup, uh, the immediate support area for the Nifty is at around 17,750, 17,700, which is the major support area on the downside. So we'll take some contra bet uh, to initiate a call ladder it's a mild bullish strategy, call letter strategy we will initiate. We will buy 17,800 call option, which was closed at around 18, 89 rupees. And we'll sell 17,900 as well as 18,000 call option. So uh, by doing this strategy, our net flow would be around 28 rupees. So we'll start making profit if Nifty manages to cross above again 17,830 zone. And if it remains uh, below 18,030 level, so if it uh, closes in this range only, then we will start making profit. So we'll take uh, contra bet because we are going to open around important support area of 17,750, which is very important support area for today's trade as well as for expiry also. So we are expecting some pullback from those levels. That's why we are initiating here call letter strategy. Moving to the stocks front, uh, capital goods sector is uh, continuously showing good strength and uh, looking at the overall setup, Siemens is looking very attractive and the uh, uh, long uh, uh, rollover is uh, happening in this stock and looking at the overall structure, we believe that you know Siemens can continue for the more upside. We are projecting target of 3370 to 3380 on the higher side. One can buy with stop loss of 3260. Uh, second stock is uh, Voltas, uh, very strong uh, really uh, since last uh, uh, three, four week. And uh, now stock is approaching uh, above its, uh, you know, uh, immediate support area. Uh, so looking at the overall setup for the Voltas, we believe that, you know, this stock can rally towards 930, 940 zone. One can buy with stop loss of 885. Uh, another stock is on the short side, that is Ipkala. Stock is now trading near to its... Uh, a uh, crucial support uh, area. Uh, looking at the derivative setup, uh, we believe that you know furthermore, uh, short position can be there in the stock, and uh, IPCA can go down further from the current level. 760, 750 are the next major support area where stock can go down in the continuation of this downfall. One can go short with stop loss of 820. All right, uh, <clears throat> Rajesh, thanks very much for that. Uh, those are uh, that's a view on the market. Uh, and 